We're here today with attorney Scott Smith in his brand new law offices. Scott, how are things going in your new firm? Everything's so far so good, Mike. Yeah, knock on wood, it, it remains that way and it stays that way. You know, like anything else in life, it takes hard work, uh, focus and discipline, and uh, with the Lord's blessing, hopefully good things will keep coming our way. Tell me about your family and how your home is permeated with the steel factor. Good question. All right, well, first I'll tell you about my family. I, I, I'm blessed to have my wife, Molly. We've been married since February 9th of 2002. I hope she sees this and sees that I remember that with no notes. Um, and then we are blessed with four healthy children after we you know, had some difficulty and, and uh, some heartache in, in, in the loss of a child uh, early on after birth uh, due to premature birth. So we're blessed now, very fortunate with four kids, Sandy, Tucker, Charlie and Harrison, maybe because of our experience, maybe not, maybe we would have been the same way, but certainly I think because of our experience, we try to give all of our time to our four kids. It's, they are everything to uh, Molly and I. You know, we're at every single school function that there is. I coach youth baseball, I coach youth football. Molly is with Sandy whenever she's riding the horse. So if I'm not here at the office, if I'm not at a deposition, if I'm not in trial, if I'm not in a hearing, I'm, I'm with my family and as is Molly. As far as the, the steel connection, well, Molly, uh, my wife, is the youngest grandchild of the late Art Rooney, and also known as the Chief. And in American folklore, he's, he's part of it. He started the Pittsburgh Steelers in 1933, or started the NFL with families like the Hallis family, the Bidwell family, and other various families that started the NFL in 1933. So we are deeply connected to the Pittsburgh Steelers and everything about the Pittsburgh Steelers. And that was tough for me at first when we first started dating, because I'm a big Miami Dolphins fan. But after um, nearly 20 years of marriage and more than 20 years of dating, I've become a Steelers fan. We've been to three Super Bowls, um, so I had no choice. <laughs> Tell me about your dogs. Well, we have 400 pounds of dogs at our house. One of them, 165 pounds unto himself. And the three dogs' names are Chief, Bettis, and Juju. And Chief, of course, is Molly's grandfather who started the Steelers. That was his nickname. Anybody just Googles Chief Art Rooney, we'll, we'll see the pictures that I think we've sports fans have all seen before. He's got the big black glasses on and the cigar in his mouth. I mean, certainly throughout the 70s when the Steelers were having their big run, uh, everybody knew who the Chief was. And then Bettis, the bus, uh, Jerome Bettis, number 36, um, this uh, Neapolitan Mastiff that we have, and he is massive, 165 pounds. He's appropriately named Bettis. And then my wife decided two dogs wasn't enough. We had to have a third dog, so now we have an old English Mastiff who will soon be 130 pounds herself. Um, she's named after Juju. It was either going to be Belle or Juju, and fortunately we chose Juju since Le'Veon Bell is no longer with the Steelers. <laughs> <laughs>